one steep start, some sweeping single tracks, and a trail that's full of surprises. We are riding the High Junk Peak mountain bike trail. Hello and welcome back to Drone and Flow. My name's Robbie, your bike trail guide. Today's episode, we're riding in Hong Kong's new territories to ride the High Junk Peak Trail. It's a new trail for me, so I'm looking forward to finding out why it's on the best bike trail list. Hey, George, I've got a quiz for you. Yeah, what is it about? You know, what's that uh, thing that happens to me when I'm on a new bike trail? Uh, you got a good new trail feeling, right? All right. In this series, I'm getting on my bike and exploring some of the best mountain bike trails Hong Kong has to offer. Mix that up with stunning sea, mountain and city views, and we've got the perfect backdrop to a great day out on the bike. We start the trail at Ng Phai Tin on Clearwater Bay Road with a short stir climb next to the pavilion. Continue on up to a left turn and follow the signs to Tai Moi. I'm half expecting this ride to be similar to Dragon's Back, but as the first set of washed out stirs appear, I realise I might have underestimated this trail a tad. With a bit of pushing, George. Full of energy, I have a go at riding up a section, but soon realise the futility of this on such a scorching hot day. Any day, really. Well, we're only a teeny weeny bit into this trail, and the, the technical climbs have already taken me by surprise. And I can't hide my heavy breathing this time round. It really is one of those trails where you're having to exert yourself from the very beginning. Let's see what else is lying in store for us. Some sections of the route are interspersed with trails designated for hikers only. Occasionally, the lack of signposts had me second guessing the directions and wondering which trail I was on, especially when faced with a long stair descent. The hiker trail occasionally branches out to some grand coastal views, while the biker one is directed into some lovely forest sections away from the sun. It would be nice to share in all of the spoils that this park has to offer, but for now, we keep to the designated bike trail. One section of the trail I'm glad to be spared from riding is the steep hiker-only route up to the summit of High Junk Peak. I'm a little envious not to be taking in the spectacular views, but carrying my bike on my back for two hours on a hiking trail is not my idea of fun. Stick to the bike trail, thanks. So I'm midpoint on the trail and I've still got that good new trail feeling going on. Admittedly, the beginning of the trail had that brutal push up the technical sections, but on the other side were these amazing downhills and interspersed by these wonderful sweeping single tracks. Got to say, it's one of those trails I just do not want to end. And it's a 10 out of 10 for me so far off this trail. Marvelous. Let's see what the rest of it holds for us. Come on. So far, I've been riding mostly under cover of shade, and I'm wondering if the views will ever open up. Soon enough, I'm gifted with a wide open vista across Clearwater Bay and beyond. The view comes with a price though, and I gladly pay my dues as I tackle some challenging, steep, rocky climbs. Yeah. So it's a pretty hot day today, and I like it that way for two reasons. One, I like the warmth, but secondly, you get less hikers on the trails, which means it's a good way to ride the trails if you want to go a little bit faster because there's no one around. Um, so that's a tip for you if you're coming out on the trails. After the brief coastal view, the route begins to gently descend, and I sense trails end is nigh. It seems like the fun is tapering off too, but suddenly the trail shapeshifts into a more homegrown style as I edge my way down some gnarly berms that leave me exiting the trail with a satisfying grin on my face. Well, we've come to the end of another trail and a great day of riding. It was only a short trail, but it was six kilometers of pure biking bliss. Hope you got the flavor of the trail and that inspires you to get on your bike and ride it as well. Well, wherever you're seeing this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And on that note, I'm Robbie, your bike trail guide with his trusty bike red, signing off for, wait for it, wait for it, drone and phone. Okay, perfect. This is a bamboo shoot. Looks lovely, 
but they're lethal if you come off your bike and hit one. So take it easy in this section.